Well, we got another brand new song. Maybe when, you know, usually when a band says we got a new song, we can just get up and go to the bathroom. <laughs> but no, this is a good one. Free. Another new song. It's uh, about a truly despicable woman. Not like the last one. Who gets her way in the end? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah.
Okay, this next song, another new song. Y'all got it from the uh, Awesome Lounge Lizards. Uh, we haven't recorded this yet either. Uh, we're still, uh, yeah, well, yes, we have recorded it. Uh, we're still thinking about putting it on our next album, but uh, gosh, it's so nasty. <laughs> we're working blue now, so look out. The radio won't play this song, hard they won't. They won't. Hell, they won't even let us play it at certain uh, venues That's right. because it's so bad. That's right. Churches, actually, actually if, uh, if you watch television these days, people are pressing up the store every, every chance they get. So they do. Basically, we, we didn't do that for 44 years. And thought, well, let's change and see what happens. So, any, anybody have a birthday coming up out there? Birthdays? Birthdays? Okay, well, this is, this is especially for him. Okay.
from the shallow end of the gene pool. My x-ray with the doctor's lab. When they tried to get my EEG weight, well, I wasn't even on the ground. Card of the bartender. Oh, 
friends for intruding this way. But there's something I just have to say. I remember that girl they're talking about just like it was yesterday. When she was small, they'd bring her into the New World Deli and sit on a stool and give her a taste of beer and laugh. And I thought to myself, oh, you crazy fools. But what can I do? What can I say? I'm just a bartender. No work here for my pay. But I can die when I hear her poor old hapless father say,
sausages the smokiest, but the neighbors are the oakiest. Tuck, tuck, and a two-cup as a dollar down the orange. Everybody in Texas has got what you're looking for. Aren't you glad that the Texas put its arms up in the sky? If heaven is a Texas partner, I don't want to die. CDs here, but we got CDs uh, available on our website, 
and uh, more likely uh, goodwill. You can find your CDs. <laughs> Punch out guns everywhere. Okay, okay it's Sunday, so we're taking you to church. By the way, Hank is our new youth minister. Yes. <laughs> uh, youth pastor. He may, may look a little grizzled around the edges, but he's really hip. I'm really hip. That's right. Yeah, he, he just told us about that word. Yeah. 23 skidoo. Uh, stop on that, Paul Larkin. Yeah, that's right. That's one right. of them said he's really sick, and I thought, oh, let's call him. Oh. Still uh, inappropriate. Oh, 
Oh, read about three sinners. Oh, once there was a sinner who built in house of straw, but did not erect his dwelling according to God's law. The Lord saw that construction and said it could not stay. Satan huffed and Satan puffed. Satan huffed and Satan puffed and he blew that house away. Don't build your house of straw. Don't build your house of straw. Don't build your house of straw or Satan will blow it down. There was another sinner who built a stick of bone. His house was not constructed according to God's code. The Lord gave him a red tag and that house it was condemned. Satan huffed and Satan puffed. Satan huffed and Satan puffed and it will not rise again. Don't build your house of sticks. Don't build your house of sticks. Don't build your house of sticks or Satan will blow it down. Then there was that sinner who finally saw the light. Built himself a house of bricks upon the highest heights. The Lord saw that construction and it followed his true plan. Satan huffed and Satan puffed. Satan huffed and Satan puffed. Satan huffed and Satan puffed. Or Satan will blow it down. <laughs> <laughs>